they are good. Eh? So in this video, I will be showing you how to make FAQ in Core 11. So all we just have to do is we'll create your column. This let's take for instance, both my question and answer. So just follow through. I can give this a color, maybe this. Then my text color can be white. Then I can give it padding. Just padding top, maybe 10 or 5. Add bottom 5. Then to the left, 10. So, and I will name this question. This will be my question. So I'll just come to advanced. My custom class, I'll type question. Now, this will be my answer. I will align it as well. I can give it maybe like 91.6. Then I can give it a background color. Something of this form. Then I'll give it my padding bottom and top as well. Let me use 5. 5. Then to the left, 20 or 30. So if I'm okay with this, then I would name this as answer. A N S W E O. So I'll name it as answer as well. So I can now duplicate in case I have multiple FAQ. So I'll move this top, move this down. Then this I can now give this page margin top to separate them for previous questions. So I can keep duplicating. Don't forget, is the, the test element I name question and answer, not the column or the session or the row is the test element. So I'm going to give you two set of codes. When we go to your tracking code, which is your footer tracking. So I'll come down to my tracking code, then I'll click on this footer, then you paste this there. So this is it, this FAQJS. So you can copy it. You can see the instruction at the top. This goes to your footer tracking code. So paste it to your footer tracking code. I click on yes, save. Then the next set of code, you are going to put it in your CSS. So you see FAQ test. So you can just copy this and paste it in your CSS. Now this function of this over BK column means your when I over on the question, what color do I want? Maybe red, or if you have a color code, you can put it there. So maybe red. Then the test color, when the over should be red or yellow. So just put the test color as well, or you use the code, and that's all you need to change. So you just click on save, you can see. So then you save. Then when you preview, you're going to see everything. Still loading. Okay. So that's how to make your FAQ in Google. Thank you.